Could you guys ever forgive each other if one of you cheated? Easy. Would you still want to be with Natalie if she didn't want kids? What's up, Easy Gang? Gang, 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 gang! I'm gonna fill you guys in on a little secret. She's drunk. Alrighty. I'm a little tip. So I'm gonna hold it down for y'all because I'm not as tipsy as her, alright? So I am going to navigate and delegate. Okay, tell this them. Episode. Tell them what's going down, Natalie. First so intro us, we, intro us. First of all, before we even get into the video, are you subscribed? Subscribe! If not, hit that subscribe Try button real quick. Turn those post notifications on. Ooh. Join the game. All right. Hey, okay. So, what's going down Today there? we are doing part two of Truth or drink. drink. You guys asked us questions. We text you not too long ago, okay? We text you earlier this week to ask us some truth or drink questions, okay? And we are ready to answer them. You ready? I'm ready, I'm ready. Y'all ready? Let's get into the questions. Let's go, Nizi gang. Boop, boop, boop. Okay, Nizi gang. So the first question is from our girl, Kim. So our girl, Kim says, what's the worst argument slash disagreement the two of you have had besides the one we all know about? What's the worst, Natalie? What's the worst? Um, Be honest, this is the truth or drink. You got either true or let's the drink. Let's see. Definitely gonna tell the truth. Okay. Um, Go ahead, tell the music game. You got five. Four. I, I don't know. There's been a three, few. There's been a few bad two. ones, but probably. Um, I don't know. Here, take a shot. Perfect. Good. Take a shot, Nat. Take a you, shot. Wait, take wait, a shot. Take a shot. Here, here. Take a shot. It's for us. All right, take a shot. Here. Uh-oh, Nat Nat's about to take a shot, y'all. It's about to go down. She's getting her taster. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what is that? What is that, cranberry juice? Uh-oh. Ooh, wee! Yeah. Our arguments aren't as bad. We've got into the worst one literally on camera. I'm sorry, but that was the worst one. All right, next question. Okay, guys. So the next question is from Darnice. Darnice. David. What up? She says. She said. What is your biggest turn on? Which is your favorite body part of Natalie? Mm, wait, are both of those my questions or? Uh, yes. Uh, my biggest turn on is probably you taking like really good care of me. Aww. The fact that you cook for me. The fact that you just like love me. You know, whenever I need you, you like you're there for me. So that's like my biggest turn on. What's right. your favorite body part? Oh, my favorite body part. Now talking about physical. That ass! Woo! Woo! I have way more to offer than that easy game. Oh my God. You know I'm drinking? That's my favorite body part. That ass! Okay, so the next question is from our girl, Michaela. She says, is easy better? Is easy better than a man? That's all she says. I mean, she's better than any man I've dated. That's why we're together. <laughs> you get on my nerves. If she wasn't, I mean, would I be here? Like, let's be real. You already knew the answer to that question. All right, so the next one is from Anisha. Anisha says, Natalie, what's your biggest turn on? From easy. What's your biggest turn on, baby? I mean, we all know it's my lips. So you gotta say something else. Okay? Think, think, think. Okay, let me think. Something that y'all don't, don't know. Okay, I would have to say, I just said this to her the other day. What'd you say? I think it's her face expression. Isn't mm -hmm. that? That's kind of weird, right? Especially this one. That's my favorite. <laughs> Her face expression. Stop! Ew! Her face expression okay. whenever she just studies me, you know? Girl! I was just trying to liven up the place. God damn! Shit! What's your favorite, baby? Which one? I just said No, but which one? No, it's just like when you study me, you just get this look on your face. 
I like that look. Like, well, wait, I don't want, when I study like. Alright, next question. Next question. All right, Rachel wants to know. What's up, Rachel? Easy. What's up, Rachel? Would you break up with your girlfriend for a million dollars? Ooh. One million. You can't we get back together either? I'm gonna just drink. No, it. no, no, no. Look, we wanna know. It's I get to choose truth or drink. You need to answer this question. A million dollars? What do you mean? Okay, I got it. I'm literally taking the million dollars and I'm breaking up with you. I thought you about to swing on me. I'm breaking <laughs> up with you for a day. You or can't me. make, they need break up, break up. No, bitch, I get to make the rules. I break up with no, your ass for a day, get to spend this $1 million. <laughs> oh my gosh. Baby, I'm literally only gonna be able to spend like, what, 100,000? I'm gonna give you at least almost 25% of that. Next question, we see where her heart's at, y'all. All right, the next question is from Snoop. Pretty sure, it's our fan page. Oh, All right. shout out to our fan page, Neezy Gang Gang underscore. Stop drinking. Sorry, I'm trying to get lit turned up. It's New Year's, oh bro. Oh my God. We got what? How many days till New Year's? Only like what? Five more days? It's only it's like not five more days. It's two days, okay? Easy. What? Tell a dirty secret that nobody knows. One of my exes literally blackmailed me to my girlfriend at the time and they almost got into a fight and I almost fought my ex. But luckily I got pulled away and I didn't fight my ex because she was saved by the bell. Wait, 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 what? How did she blackmail you? I'm cool with a lot of my exes, but one of my specific exes is fucking crazy. I literally went to go buy a desk from her ass. Like literally she was selling the desk and I'm like, yo, like- That's so random. I was buying a desk. She was buying a desk. I was buying it. See, see, if she was my girlfriend at the time, she wouldn't believe it. I was literally buying a desk. My girlfriend at the time, Literally knew about it, okay? I was buying a desk for my room. I was trying to make it a game room, make it lit, okay? I'm buying a desk. Everything's all peaches and cream, right? So I literally leave my phone on the counter. We chopping it up. I go to the bathroom. Like, I'm thinking everything's smooth. Then I get a call from my girl. Burr, burr. Yo, what the f Everything going all crazy. Like, she just talking and like, f you, f you. I'm about to break up with you, f you. You know, and I'm like, yo, calm down. Calm down! And then she, I'm like, what's going on? She's like, yo, your ex just sent me a naked picture from your phone. Bruh! Bruh, my name She said my girl and First of all, I'm seeing holes all through the story. You know, the detective in me. Let me put my detective hat on. All right, what's the, how was there holes in the story? How did she have your passcode? And, and everyone has a lock on. Bro, the, the girl is crazy. I literally asked her the same exact question. You know what she said? She said, it's your birthday. I'm like, dummy, why would I put my birthday as my freaking password, bro? All right, we gotta talk about this off camera because I don't know about this story. What? Wait, what? So, Neezy Gang, what would you, that isn't even, I can't even lie, like what? I was buying a desk, baby, she sent the freaking nude. I have to, I have to lie about the truth. I had to, I tried to lie Which about the truth. Which other gang? I don't want to hear nothing else from her. We why is she enough. mad? Why are you mad? We heard enough. Wait a minute, why are you heard mad? Enough Wait, why are you mad? Why are you mad? We've heard enough. Comment below. Does this sound like a lie? Does this sound like an ain't no lie? Ain't <laughs> person. Natalie. Lie? Hey, before we get into it now, you tell me, why are you upset? It wasn't you, I wasn't your girlfriend at the time. Because! Why? I, I just, you know, I'm offended for her, all right? Because you insulted her intelligence and the fact that she believed it? You're my best friend, you know that happened, I told you. All right, so what would you have done in this situation? I don't think I would have believed her, to yeah, be honest. I couldn't believe, even if it was vice versa, I wouldn't believe it, it sounds too freaking I can't believe she believed it. She did, she took me back. I next question. Okay, so the next question is from Shay. 
Yo, Shay, we lit, so what kind of questions you got, girl? Could you guys ever forgive each other if one of you cheated? It's a no for me. It's yeah. a no. It's a no. It's a no. It's a no. I feel bad for the person that you cheated with and you, girl, because I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, bro. I'm like, what would you do? I, it's just a no for me. I feel like, you know, there's a certain things that are just, not tolerable yeah. and that's one of them like I don't I'm not married I don't have kids like why she you know what I'm saying yeah so next yeah. question next question next question okay this next question is interesting and I actually would love to hear this okay what this is from it doesn't say who okay easy yes. would you still be with Natalie if she didn't want kids You gonna drink to that one? <laughs> Y'all know, like, she's wanted kids since she was 18. Like, she was gonna be one of them moms. Yeah. So, uh, I think that just kind of spoke for it. I could tell the truth or I could drink. I decided to drink! <laughs> All right, next question. Okay, Raven, not Simone, but Evan says, would you leave Natalie for Chris? Brown. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, 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 okay. So there's some truth to those little TikToks that she makes, that she likes the boys. Nah, I just wanted to drink on that one, baby. Nah, 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 nah. Chris Brown, I love Chris Brown. You know I love Chris Brown. That's why she being goofy right now. I love Chris Brown, but nah, no man can make me ever leave Natalie. No man. Next question. Natalie. Would you still date women if you and Easy broke up? <laughs> I have no idea. I really don't. Like, you will go straight back to men. Sometimes I think that, but then I don't know. I don't know. I honestly, it would just depend. It would really back depend. Do you think so? I know so. Definitely, I know so. Anyway. Oh, the questions start getting juicy, juicy. <laughs> oh, she getting lit, lit, y'all. Next question. Oh my God. All right, what's the next question? Okay, so the next question, I think we answered this. Maybe we didn't answer it, but they want to know, have we done it? You know, have me, you done it. The do, the duty do. I'm just gonna have to get my salt ready. <laughs> but they, there was a second question, and if so, wait. If so, is Easy the best person? Am I the best person you slept with? I feel like this is an inappropriate question. Shame on you. Too. Really? Shania, you asked me that too when I text you. She asked me that same question. Who's our favorite? You're taking a shot? You gonna say which one your favorite ex is? I All right, go ahead. Yeah. Say, go ahead then, say, let the world know. Say who I'm not gonna say the name. Well, how do you, how do you literally say who your favorite ex is without saying their name? I can describe them. Okay, describe your favorite. My favorite ex was probably my ex from 
high school. I think because we were so young, we just didn't even experience all the adult drama that you have to go through. So it was just like fun. You know, those little childish relationships that are just fun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why are you looking like that? Okay, Lisa Gang. I'm good. I'm good. No, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I thought he was being honest. Alright, alright, fine. Okay, so. I mean, obviously they met exes for a reason, so, you know. But I was just like, you know, there's certain exes that I was like, alright, the relationship wasn't that bad. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> All right, easy gang. Thank you so much for tuning in. We're lit. I'm lit. Natalie's not lit. Are you lit? Are you I'm gonna tip. Little tip. Little tip. tip. She just had to tip in. Just you know? a tip. <laughs> All right, Lisa Gay, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Give this video a huge thumbs up and please, please, please follow us on all of our social media accounts. Easy X Natalie, Natalie Odell, and Young Easy. We love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in. Happy New Year. Make sure y'all turn up because we're turning up. New Year's editions, truth to drink. It's lit. Easy Gay, we, we out! out! Wait, Easy Gay, wait. Okay, y'all still here. Uh, before we go, I'm a little lit. I mean, it's okay though. It's okay. We're family. We're family. But before you guys go, I wanted to do this video. I've been holding off on it, and I feel like this is the perfect moment. I wanted to tell Natalie how I really feel while I'm drunk. Hopefully, I can set up the camera and everything's good. And uh, yeah, we're going to get it popping. So make sure y'all, I don't think I can pick my hair out with braids. But make sure y'all stay tuned for the next video. I'm going to film it right, right now. Give this video a huge thumbs up if you guys want to see it. Um, uh, yeah, I'm gonna tell her how I really feel while being drunk. Um, yeah, like it, follow us, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And stay tuned for the next video. Hey, we've been drinking already. Oh my god. <laughs> okay! Wait, I'm not ready. You ready? You ready? Classy. Bougie Ratchet. Is her name Carol? Yeah. Carol Basket. Bougie Ratchet. I'm drunk. I'm up. The no fuck? Anyway, Snoop wants to know. Snoopy Snoop. Snoopity Scoop. I forget the question. Let me like real quick.